Alrighty, uh, Dirk back with you, wrapping up trench camp. Got with me from Quarter Lane High School, a couple of the standout linemen uh, linemen that were here. Um, tell me your uh, name, height, weight, and your year in school. I'm, my name is Devin Ward, and I'm about 6'5", 270 pounds. Nice. And I'm going to be a senior in okay. high school. All right, and Devin, uh, you've been a part of the Quarter Lane program for the, your whole career as a high school football yeah. player? Yeah, I've okay. been varsity since sophomore year. All right, great program up there. Um, so did you get to be a part of the state championship team? Was it two years ago? Yeah. Okay, pretty I, nice. I played left guard then. Yep. Oh, you did? Got out, got on the field, and where'd they hold that at? Oh, oh, it was down at Boise State. Boise State, yep. pretty nice. Had yep. to be a good nice. feeling to walk nice off there. Uh, Quarter Lane's got some real power this year. You've got... Uh, uh, Chase Blakely, one of the outstanding tight ends in the country, committed UW. You've got Gunnar Amos. You've got uh, Addison Johnson. Johnson. Yeah, some standout skill guys. You linemen that showed up um, showed yourselves very well. Some of the top guys here. You had a teammate here with you. Um, how's things looking for that team this year? How are you feeling about the season? I feel like we're going to do pretty well. Yeah. Because we have a lot of returners and I think we'll do pretty well this year. You guys seem very well coached, disciplined team. Uh, uh, how's the atmosphere at Coeur d'Alene just overall for football? Oh, it's great. Amos is a great coach yeah. and just fun all around. All right. Living in Coeur d'Alene's got to be pretty special. I mean, you live there, you guys probably take it for granted, but anybody that's spending time there knows it's a great outdoors place. Uh, you got all four seasons, you get to swim yep. and stuff. What's your favorite part about being up in Coeur d'Alene and living there? Oh, I just like the lakes and they're fun to swim in and in the yeah. wintertime going skiing. Mountains. Oh, yeah. Mountains are pretty close. You so. get a big amusement park up there too, don't you? Yep, Silverwood. That's a growing area because the Idaho economic system is really favorable to corporations, so a lot of people moving up there, isn't it? Yeah. Well, what about you for college? Um, what are your aspirations? Anyone talking to you right now? Uh, yeah, I have a couple coaches talking to me. Okay. The coach at Harvard, Yeah. he's been talking to me, the recruiting awesome. guy. And Colorado School of Mines as well. Okay. Their small school, both small schools and both really good at schools. Have you got yep. the grades for a Harvard type program? Yep. Got 3.9. Oh, that'll work. Yep. Are you giving that some thought? Yeah. Have you done a visitation back to the Ivy League? Yeah, I did the camp a couple weeks ago. Okay. And how'd that go? It went pretty well. Awesome. Well, there's a lot of kids from the Northwest playing at Harvard, Yale, Dartmouth, all over Columbia. So hopefully that becomes an opportunity. You're certainly big enough to play in the big sky or maybe even beyond. Um, so for you, what's the best thing about looking for a fit for college? The uh, academics or what? Will the academics be a big part of that? Yeah, academics will be a big part. I'm looking at being engineer, some okay. type of engineer, All right. and hopefully skiing next near. But like to ski, huh? Yeah. Yeah, you're a big dude for skiing. Yep. I tried. I never could do it. <laughs> All right, man. Listen, great camp. Um, appreciate you guys coming down from Coeur d'Alene. Take take what you learned back up there to to uh, Washington, and you know, make it happen. All right, thanks. All right, thanks for your time. Yep.